a look at the consumer's energy outage map this morning. A lot of improvements from Tuesday, and uh, while a lot of those uh, outages have been solved, still a lot of people still stuck in the dark this morning. Let's check in with our Andy Curtis live in Muskegon. We know one of the hardest hit areas this week with a look at what consumers is saying about uh, restoration efforts. Good morning. Hey, good morning, Janice. Good morning, Elliot. Uh, we're in Twin Lakes specifically here in Muskegon County on River Road. And a lot of residents, a few of whom we've uh, of which we've talked to this morning, say they are still without power. They are a few of the 11,000 customers still without power, according to Consumers Energy Outage Map. And the big reason is this. Trees from that storm brought down on top of uh, power lines all over the area. Now, we did get a press release from consumers at 7 o'clock this morning, a little after 7 o'clock, and they told us that they have more than 90% of customers impacted by Tuesday's massive storms. They have their power back on. Again, over 90% of customers that were affected do have their power restored. They have more than 550 crews, including crews from different states, five different states here, working to restore power. Line workers are working 16-hour shifts and they are hoping to have the remaining power for those 11,000 customers restored by the end of today. And another thing that is very important, especially with scenes like you're seeing right here on River Road, stay at least 25 feet away from downed power lines, even if they look like the, that they're, they're dead lines, like the power's off. I know that's something we kept running into when we were out surveying storm damage yesterday, that there were power lines down. There was some caution tape up around it, but I don't know if the tape had been taken down, ripped through by people people walking around the area or just blown down. But the scene didn't look as secure as it was probably Tuesday morning. But consumers are saying still be smart, play it safe. And if the power does look like it's off to those lines, still stay at least 25 feet away just to be on the safe side. Now, we'll be here for the rest of the morning in Muskegon County. And as the power starts to come back on to customers, we will report it here and on our website, fox17online.com. Reporting from Twin Lake, Andy Curtis back to you guys in the studio.